everyone, let's take a look at uh, number four. So here it says, give the axis of symmetry and the vertex for this graph. Now again, you could use your calculator, but I I'm just gonna go with the standard way to find it algebraically. So if I look at my function and I'll write it here, four x squared minus 16 x plus 19. If I think about the quadratic formula, I would have a equaling four, b equaling negative 16 and c equaling 19. And there's a quicker, or I think of like a quick and dirty formula to get the vertex or at least the x coordinate. And that formula is always negative b over 2a. So let's see what that gives us. That would be negative of negative 16 over 2 times 4. So that would basically be 16 over 8 or 2. All right, so I know that the x coordinate of my vertex is 2. That's going to rule out these last two options. If I want to find the y coordinate, then let's find f of 2. So this would be 4 times 2 squared minus 16 times 2 plus 19. So this would be 4 squared is 16. Nope, that's not true. Four, 2 squared is 4. 4 times 4 is 16. That's what I meant to say. Um, 16 times 2 is 32 plus 19. All right, so we've got 16 minus 32. That would be negative 16. If I add 19 to it, I'm going to get 3. So then my vertex must be the ordered pair 2, 3. And that would make my axis of symmetry. It would have to be x equals 2 because it needs to match that x coordinate. So that would get me a. All right. Thanks so much, everyone. Bye.